Star Wars Season of Fours. Da -da -da -da. We are going to get in here. And it's so crowded. And the banner's out of you see the Season of Fours banner. Banner, banner, banner. And here's the Star Tools. So right now, standby, it's about an hour for the Star Tours. Oh, I got you. In the background, you can hear the music. So obviously, the right side is the green one. The left side is the red one. So this is the light side. That's the dark side. So when you come to the Tomorrowland season four, you gotta pick a side. It gets a souvenir. the Jedi sign and up there is the hyperspace mountain which I think the wait time is about two hours okay so we got this superhero HQ over here <laughs> and here it is, the Star Wars launch bay. Hello. Hello. Oh, they closed till 8 p.m. So this used to be the Tomorrow Night Innovation. The bottom floor, the first floor used to be the, the life of a tree, the dream house. It's like a smart computer house. So they knock it down and they make it into the season of fours, the Star Wars lunch bay. So right now this building is like a little preview of the new Star Wars land that's coming. So you can come over here at Tomorrow Land. And then they have all these lines on the side. Now the bottom floor is for the Star Wars Season of Force. The top floor that you can go from the other side is for the um, Superhero Headquarters HQ. Oh, you. So I'm so excited. We're here to see the uh, Season of Force. So first, you're gonna see this kind of like a really cool, like a carpet, but with the Star Wars movie feeling. Wow, there's just so much stuff over here, and it's a lot of lights. a lot of like the paintings so like lots of Star Wars painting over here and then here they have a lot of the stone trooper and the Star Wars character display so this is the life-size first soldier Star Trooper statues is that $9,000? is that for sale? And we got some of the toys. Uh, so they're making it Disney. This one they're on off. Uh, uh, 
you with us, buddy. So over here, you can get the lightsaber, and you can get the uh, BBA, the Troy BBA. Oh, how much is this one? This is an umbrella. Are you serious? This is an umbrella. So here's a lot of toys over here. It's like 140 each. Title of the company. Uh, where's it was on here earlier? There it is. Metal Earth, 3D Metal, Earth. Metal Earth models. They also you can buy these at uh, like Barnes and Nobles. I've seen them at Japanese bookstores. I've seen them everywhere. Honestly, just any place where you can do a little hobby, I'm sure they sell them. Yeah, they show directions. Oh, friends! So a lot of stuff over here, and then. I, this is where you check out. Even the checkout station is like really, really cool. Like uh, when you take off on the airplane. So this is so awesome. So this one is uh, around three hundred dollars. Well, this one's two eighty, and that one's three hundred dollars. And over here, uh, this their autographs photos. This one is uh, $600. Princess Leah is $245. R2-D2 is $140. So there are different prices. And this one is $200. And the whole crew is $2750. Wow. Oh, this is my favorite BBA. Oh, I used to do these kind of things. The sketch plates on a sketch print in my art class. That's a BBA. Ooh. Wow, well, this one's cool. So it's kind of like a sketch pad, like a plate, a mall. I don't know what they're making. Probably um, iPhone or tech stuff. And over here we have the uh, wow. Oh look, that's what it is. Oh look, you can buy it. You can buy it. Yeah, it's a costume. Oh, cool. Those are the helmets. Four thousand dollars for a Dark Vader costume. Does it come with the helmet? Oh. Wow. Oh, this is the D Tag on demand. So there's all kinds of different phone cases. And then you can choose a case, choose a art, and personalize it. And you can do it here. Even the exit looks so cool. 